yo what is up what is going on guys it is Blemzy here and today we are going to watch a streamer yeah an old school streamer Ryan Choi he got known for uh, he was NA challenger and got known for building four Doran's blaze on Rengar back in the day um, yeah he, he was really known in season 4 season 3 uh, season 5 he star uh, stopped streaming but now he's back, so uh, take a look at if he still plays the same way. And I thought, ah, oh, might as might as well make a commentary out of this and share it with you guys, right? Sorry for the bad quality, but it is his stream. So first of all, for runes, he is taking electrocute in the top lane. This game he's playing against Singed. It is kind of an annoying matchup, though. Grasp, I think, would have been better here because the poison of Singe is just gonna stack up your grasp really easily. But you know, Ryan Choi, Ryan Choi doesn't uh, do, doesn't go defensive. Immediately flashes in, goes for the kill. Damn! Surprised he was in rage there still. Holy shit! Immediately TP's back. Singe doesn't get punished early because teleport is a retarded summoner spell and death timings are too short. And Ryan has to go back now. Like look at how fucking fast that was though. He got killed and immediately it TP back. So stupid, so dumb. And now he's gonna miss all that CS, that's kinda kinda sad, but Stacking up those Doran's blades, like the old school Rangar does, or the old school Ryan Choi. Yeah, Sinch is just gonna proxy this wave. Yeah, Ryan needs to buy a Tiamat here in order to, in order to deal with the proxy of uh, Sinch. Yeah, Singe probably just backed, he's gonna, well I think he's gonna buy a, a Dark Seal or something, should have gold enough. Pretty nice uh, music choice Ryan has nowadays. I kinda like this, uh, this jazz, what is it? Shaco invading the Kazakhs. Singe doesn't move, so they have no vision. It's gonna immediately jump and proc electrocute. Since he's gonna try to proxy this, nah, he cannot chase it. Maybe Sha if Shaco comes, maybe they can kill him. But I don't even think it's worth chasing the Saints right now. He's gonna lose all the minions if he does chase. Sh oh, Shaco! Yeah, Shaco asking for help, but I don't really think. Eh. Okay, they got him. Nice. Diana roamed. That's pretty good. Diana got a kill pre 6. Ryan Choi got known for his Doran's build. He basically built four Doran's, a Tiamat, and a Last Whisper back in season. Uh, a Brutalizer. Brutalizer and Last Whisper back in season 4. Stacking up those Dorans, four Dorans already. Then you know it's Ryan Choi, right? It's really funny to see how his build still didn't change. He uh, still goes the Dorans and probably goes Lethality and CDR afterwards. The old Brutalizer man, holy shit I miss those days. 
It gave 25 AD, 10% CDR and then armor penetration for like 1300 gold, it was so good. Yeah, Sinch is just gonna proxy again. Like there's not much you can do against that, to be honest. Especially without ult. Nah. And even with ult, I don't even think you can kill him. Very annoying champion to play against Singe. Uh, if Ryan buy, buys a Tiamat right now, it's way easier to proxy the wave. Oh, there. Kha'Zix is coming. Maybe he can kill him. If he ult right now, he could have killed him. There, Red is coming up. He should... Uh, there he is, Kha'Zix. I'm pretty sure he can get a double kill here if he ults. Yeah, this is so free. Holy shit. Snare. Ignite. There you go. Free double kill. Alright, so he's taking this wave. Diana should go top right now. Oh, Diana's going bad. Now Ryan needs to go top. I think the right play here was Diana going top. So Ryan could base and not miss CS. Or when Riot could base, go top, and then Diana could take the CS top lane. And then go mid. Now all the CS top is lost, so. Right. Like, that's a lot of CS wasted. Shouldn't have happened. But he, uh,. Has picked up a TMS, so he is. He can easily uh, deproxy it or proxy it as well. Oh, bro, don't chase the Saints. Oh, Jenna is coming for some reason. Yikers, bro. Look at all the CS he missed. You don't want to get this game to late game against Saints. You can really split push against them. You're never gonna kill him. Ooh, stops the recall. I don't know. I don't think it's worth. <laughs> like seriously, all those people chasing Saints, but if Kha'Zix was there, Jenna would have been dead. So he TP's back. I'm curious what items he has. Ninja Tabby and Double Dark Seal with a Corrupting Potion. <laughs> yeah, I don't think Ryan can even do damage on him. At least he has the Yamat, he can... Oh wait. Gets flinged. Yeah, that's a free kill. <sighs> Flashes. Yeah, still gets the kill, nice. Ryan Choi is legendary. Whoa, three man fear. Oh no, it's a uh, Shaco ult fear. Technically, that are three or two. So Ryan picks up the mobility boots, clearly he wants to roam because there's not much he can do against Saint. So right here he looks to roam bot, but he doesn't have ult up and this better pays off because, well, otherwise he will lose his turret for free. Without ult you want to get in a bush without being seen, so that's probably what, is, what he is gonna try to do. Uh, the wave is pushing, so that's kinda bad. The wave is pushing towards Ryan, I mean. There's not much he can do here, and Sinch is just keep pro- Oh, something's going on. Alright, Lucian is retarded. Gets a free kill, loses first turret for it though. Uh, 
four for all set or four uh, bone tooth necklace stacks. Yeah, that's the kind of thing. It's also Shaco. Shaco not defending top lane. But Ryan should say, like, hey, I'm gonna gank bot, can you hold top? Or, you know. But it's whatever, first third. Not that big of a deal. I was expecting up a free kill. This Jenna has a very interesting playstyle to say the least. I mean, she has roamed more than she was bot lane, so... <laughs> Ooh, Shaco dead. Alright, Ryan has ult, so we shoot. Uh, decides not to go for anything. He's Lucian solo, but he is gonna kill him. He w oh, misses the snare. That's bad. Feels bad, man. Still gets to save the turret and a lot of CS. If Lucian stays, he's dead, but I don't think he will be. Eh, okay, maybe he is that stupid. Yeah. Did he show himself? Huh. Uh, he showed himself, I think. Or Lucian is. Yeah, now he shows. <sighs> Misses the jump there. That's kind of bad, actually. Still gets him, though. Alright. That was stupid by that Lucian. You know Rengar isn't that bush. Why would you do that? And this is high, high elo, by the way. People still make mistakes like that. Maybe he didn't understand the jump range. Yeah, Ryan wants to go top. Then again, why are four people of them hanging around in the jungle? Should definitely someone... Alright, Diana goes bot, that's fine. Guys set top, now Ryan can take red and kill uh kill air god. I would have taken the red actually. Uh I don't Yeah, he's gonna get in range. Three kill. <laughs> Clean. Hello. Why is Shaco here? Should be free. At least the Soraka. Yeah, that's a double kill free. Nice too. <laughs> I don't know what the next rake is. First rake was an ocean, not that important. Jenna very low, I don't know. Ooh, yeah, that was stupid. Jenna shouldn't have it. That's literally ending. Damn. Kaisa. Kaisa, by the way. Oh, uh, so it's a cloud rake. You know, Cloud Drake is not that bad actually. Rangar, especially. It's uh, pretty decent. But I'm pretty sure Rangar or Ryan Choi runs a relentless hunter. I think his runes are Electrocute, Southern Impacts, Eyeball Collection, Relentless Hunter, then he goes Precision as Secondary 3. Um, and he takes Triumph and cut down, I think. And not Coup de Gras, but the, the more HP the enemy has, the more damage you do. Or the more HP enemy has more than you. <laughs> no, Rangar is not, or Rainchoi is not known for 
having the most efficient runes. But, you know, it works for him. It's pretty, like, most of the games aren't even decided by runes. It's like, games are decided by who gets the re most retarded teammates. Rune is only like a, a percentage that really matters. Alright, pick up a free drake. I don't think it's even worth going obese right now. Like when you have that wind drake and relentless hunter. I think the Moby, like, there's a cap, a movement speed cap. Right, I see Lucian solo pushing top. Oh no, the Soraka. Should be easy. Double kill if he goes for it. I mean, he's fat as fuck. So what Ryan should do right now is push the outer, split push, push, uh, kill the outer turrets, then group or split push, doesn't really matter. He dies for it though, it's not worth for the support. Should have waited till the whole team was there. Maybe yeah, Kaisa can still clean this up. Uh, overall, it was pretty okay. It's not that bad. He should have waited though. Like, this is a common Rengar player mistake. Dying for the support only. In this case, it wasn't that bad because they actually won the team fight after it, but... You know, it's his first dead. Gives away a huge bounty. Wasn't really all that necessary though. Yeah, Ryan should definitely go bot right now. Push mid, go bot, get the outer turrets. Look to kill someone with ult right now. He goes back for his ghost blade. Oh, that looks pretty free. The invisibility, he thought he could jump. Feels bad, man. Pick up. Picks up the ghost blade. It's alright. CDR lethality. Really important. You should just ult. Yeah. Look for the one shot. The singed annoying champion. Then again, you should definitely look to split push. Like the general rule of thumb is before you group mid right now, you wanna get the other turret at top and bot lane. Like they're just randomly picking up kills, but they're not doing. I think. Oh, damn. Yeah, that's very bad. <laughs> Quite a bit of mistakes happening right here. Yikers. Wait, they're actually gonna lose Baron for this. Shaco is bot. What the? As a oh no, they're not going for it. But as a jungler, you never, you cannot go bot like that. But also the the players, if your jungler is bot, please don't die. Don't risk it. Wait, who the fuck runs exhaust on? Oh yes, that spell book, right? 
Bikers, bro. Mistake after mistake. This is how you throw games, by the way. Again, I don't see a reason why Ryan isn't the pushing top lane. And Diana's bot, so. I think a really good they have a really good team comp to go like what the fuck is Jenna doing? Holy shit. This is high elo by the way. Diamond one or some shit. Holy fuck. They have a really good team comp to uh to go one three one three mid with Diana bot Ryan top. Now they're gonna lose Baron because Shaco is dead. And Diana has bought. Uh, Diana decides to TP here. Alright, they can't stop the Baron. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Kha'Zix kinda tanky, yeah they lost the game, they surrendered, a lot of mistakes happening, not all Ryan's fault, his team did kinda suck, oh well, <laughs> feels bad man, let's see what elo this was, demoted diamond 3, yeah that's how we throw games by the way boys, <laughs> Well, that was that. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys uh, have learned how to not throw games. Like, I think I pointed out like mistakes he made. Hope you guys uh, learned something. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.